Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to Dyer's Kitchen. I'm Austin Sutton, and I'm here today to bring you hot dogs. I know we have made hot dogs many times, many ways, and many forms, but today I'm gonna show you the basic hot dog for the best taste that you ever had with the secret that most people have had never done before. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started with it. I'm gonna go ahead and start making the chili first, the hot dogs, and I'm also gonna plate it up for you. So let me go ahead and get started with this. First thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and put some oil in this uh, hot pan. And I'm gonna go ahead and add a half a pound of ground beef. Now, I got my pan too hot, I'm gonna put the pan down. Get off for a second. I'm gonna start with chopping it up. On the chili, you want small pieces, and you know, if you want it a little chunkier, you can. But I'm shooting for small pieces. If this cool down, I already got the spices. Okay, I will have the ingredients down below, so I'm gonna put it back on there because I, I didn't want it too hot. And what you want to do is just chop this up real fine, okay. And I suggest that you use a metal spatula for this because it cuts it up even better than a spoon or a plastic one. So you, that's my suggestion for you. I'm gonna go ahead and let this go on just like this. Now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna add some ingredients. What I got is a teaspoon of pepper. Throw that on there. Okay, teaspoon of salt. Teaspoon of a cumin powder. Okay, and this right here is dark chili powder. Put this on there just like that. If the color, I'm gonna be paprika. Okay, put it all in there like that. And then I'm gonna stir it up. It smells really good with fresh spices. I'm going for right now, what I'm doing is for the flavor, okay? That's where I want it. See, I'm gonna chop up if I go. And I don't want to cook it where, when you're cooking this meat like this, you don't want it to be hard. This is chili. So I'm not gonna fry it to be hard right now. So I got it right where I want it at right now. Now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna add um, eight ounces. Tomato sauce, six, two cans of it. Okay. Then I'm gonna add six ounces of tomato paste. Just like that. Okay. And you get your choice of your brand that you want in there. Let's stir this up. And it's smelling good. Look how it's looking. And what I'm gonna do is put it to the side and let it simmer. Good old chili. Now what I'm gonna add it is something else. Let me stir this up first. Now I'm gonna go through the spoon. I don't want this too watery. I want it to just be thick, but I'm gonna let it simmer down. And you're gonna see what I'm talking about. What I wanna do, I wanna add a little sugar in this. I'm not trying to make it sweet. You got this acid, tasting, I mean, acidity that's in it. And you wanna take it out. This is gonna level it out. So it's not gonna be sweet, but it's gonna give a balance of flavor. And that's what we always strive for in this kitchen, is flavor. So now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna let this simmer down for maybe about 25 minutes. Then I'm gonna come back and let you see the results. All right, I'm back. And what I wanna do now is go ahead and put a little oil in this pan. And what I got is beef hot dogs. I put it in the pan just like this and I'm gonna simmer. Again, if it's something too hot, get all the control it. I'm gonna just roll around. Let it go for a few minutes. 
Oh ni. Come back up here. Two minutes. All right. And I'm gonna roast it. A lot of people can boil it. A lot of people grill it. I like grilling, but we don't have the option today because the weather's bad. But I have a secret. You know how we're gonna do it. I'm gonna bring that secret to you today with hot dog. Now you probably haven't seen this before, but I'm gonna show you. And that's how we're gonna do it. See how I'm getting the char? Look at that. Let it go on. But what I'm gonna do differently this time. Da 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 da. Bam! This is liquid smoke. So what you're doing is, while this is roasting now, like I'm doing here, you wanna put half a teaspoon of liquid smoke in this pan. And watch this. Watch what it's gonna do. Put a liquid smoke in that pan and put that lid on it. Just like that. About a minute. And just let it do its thing. Now, while I'm doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, look at this chill. Oh my goodness. I wish you could smell it. It's coming to the time, about 20 something minutes on it. Just let it go about a few more minutes, about five more minutes. And this chili is delicious. Now remember, if you want your chili to be a little thinner, you add a little bit of water to it. Again, depending on, depending on how you want your chili, if you want it uh, not so, so uh, salty, put less salt. Do half a teaspoon, and then you can add more salt to it if you need to. I added two teaspoons of sugar to this because the acidity in it was balanced off. So now the balance is good. But you do to your description of how you want to uh, have the old chili. And like I said, if you want it spicy, add a little bit more spice to it, okay? This is going to be delicious. I'm going to go ahead and get these hot dogs going, and I'm going to get back with you in a minute. Let me show you this on this. And look at the smoke coming out here. Boy, this is the flavor there. Look at that. Oh my goodness. And that's what you call flavor. It's got the smoke leaves in it. And now I'm just gonna sit it there for a few minutes and let it rest. Just keep it roasting slowly. Boy, I'll go ahead and plate it and get ready for the hot dog bun. Now today, I know you know how to fix a hot dog and stuff, but I'm gonna show you a trick with how to fix these hot dogs. Let's go ahead and look. It's got these hot, look at these hot dogs, how they came out. I mean, and they're hot. Look at the chili. Look at that. And I went on here and diced some onions and I made some slaw and you can buy some slaw already made. And I got some homemade pickles and then I got a little bit of cheese that I'm gonna put on here. Now, let me show you what I'm gonna do. I went on ahead and tried to air fry this to make the bun toast because I don't like my uh, bun to split in half. But I usually just preference me. I like my buns kind of soft, but sometimes I do like it toasted. So it's up to you how you want to do it. But anyway, let me show you this right quick. All right, I'm gonna use, these are, this is hot, look at this hot dog. I'm gonna put this hot dog in here just like this. I'm gonna show you something how to do it. Put some mustard on here. And I got a big ketchup, so but it, it works. Ketchup. Now, when you get your hot dog, this is what you do. You twist it, just like that. All right? Look at this. I'm gonna put this all the way. Look at this chili. Look at that. Oh, man. That's smelling good. Okay? Then I'm gonna give me some slaw. Now, what you see here is a, a hot dog all the way. That y'all way. <laughs> all right? I'm gonna sprinkle a couple onions on this. Look at that. And there you go, a hot dog all the way. So now I'm gonna go ahead and plate some more. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna do one, a chili hot dog, and then I'm gonna also do one with mustard and mayonnaise. And I'll show you in a minute. All right, all right, all right. Now, the final product. Da 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 Look at this right here. You got your hot dog all the way. You have on this one, open it up. This is mayonnaise and mustard hot dog. With just a little cheese, very good. And this is your chili hot dog. And I wanna have homemade pickles on there and some potato chips, that's what we use to do. But I'm telling you, try that with a little smoke 
like I showed you the liquid smoke and I brought that secret to you again, like we always do. You do that and you put those together and just a basic uh, recipe that we always do with hot dogs. But like I said, Dad Y'all Kitchen is always trying to find something to give that BAM to you. And I did it again today. So I brought this to you, but before I go today, I'm gonna bite on one of these hot dogs. Let me see. This is delicious. Again, I told y'all make you say dad y'all. You gonna say dad y'all when you hit this hot dog this time. You hit hot dogs many ways. Try it the way I showed you today. I'm gonna go ahead and end the day saying, be kind to somebody, cause it makes them happy. It makes yourself happy and it makes the world a better place. But remember to subscribe and the like button. Hit the like button also. Let me know how you do. How you like the, um, the recipes. It's very important to me. Again, I appreciate your support. I thank you from the bottom of my heart. Again, I got to show you this again. This is good. I got to go and eat on this hot dog. But you take care.